the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 My dear brothers, sisters, and all my little children. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are happy to greet all our fathers and sisters. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Some of our reverend fathers have these days operations and treatments and all. Let us also keep all of them in prayer. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Dear brothers and sisters, the Lord loves us so much. Praise the Lord. Praise the Hallelujah. Lord. Hallelujah. That Jesus says, the same way as Father has loved me, I love you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Father has loved me so much that I can't but love you. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And the way Father's love is unlimited, without any boundary, I also love you the same way. Praise the Lord. Praise Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The way Father has glorified the Son, the Son is ready to glorify the children of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let us now listen to St. John's Gospel, chapter 17, verse 22. I gave them the same glory. The same glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The same glory that Father has given. Let's continue to listen. You gave me. So the same glory which Father has given. That same glory Jesus is giving back to the disciples. Yes. So that they may be one just as you and I are one. The glory of God that Father, Son and the Holy Spirit are sharing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The same glory will be granted to those children, those disciples who trust and believe and who accompany Jesus. Praise the Lord. Praise Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The disciples of Christ will always bring unity Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If you are a person who brings unity in your house, the glory of God is there with you. If you are a person who brings glory of God in your parish, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. you will be always standing for the unity of the church. Praise the Lord. Praise the Hallelujah. Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Where there is discord, where there is disharmony, where there is disunity, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. there the kingdom of the devil is at the hand. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Jesus told the disciples, you go and proclaim that the kingdom of God is at the hand. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So when the reign of the Lord comes, there will be unity among the children of God. How this unity will take place? Praise the Lord. Praise this the Lord. unity can be brought out by a total surrendering of oneself. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. As you surrender, your will will not take place. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The mother, our mother Mary is great because she surrendered herself to the father. Surrender herself to the father's will. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And Father from heaven accepted her surrendering. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 Let us try to bring the great unity of heaven in our family. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Father loves the Son. Son loves the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. 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 Holy Spirit loves Father and Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise so this mutual love brings in unity and in unity the glory of God is shining. 
Praise the Lord. Praise the Hallelujah. Lord. Hallelujah. Today I welcome each of you to strive to bring the unity of Christ in our families. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Now let us listen to the testimony with the desire that I will become a testimony of Christ's love to the world. Praise the Lord. Praise the Christ Lord. loves the world so much. Praise the Lord. Praise the that Lord. the Father's love comes through Jesus to the world. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Father's love that comes through Jesus to the world is the testimony that we are listening. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Let us with an open heart listen to the testimony of the Lord and believe that this same God who is performing these miracles is alive in my family. Let us give our ears to the testimony now. Praise the Lord. I am Dr. Svetlana from Vasai. I am giving my testimony during the COVID uh, period. Uh, what happened with me? I was handling the COVID patients and once I had, a, uh, I had to go for a home visit. Uh, she was my COVID patient, so I could not refuse that. And when I went to her, I had I did not take any precautions. I had no kit. I uh, just wore a small mask. And uh, after I came from that visit, within one or two days, I started getting a, uh, symptoms like body ache and symptoms of uh, COVID. So um, I, I experienced that this can be possible that I may have uh, COVID. So uh, on, on that night when I was sleeping, uh, my body was paining and I felt like feverish. And suddenly during that time, I, I, could, I saw a vision. In that, I saw some a dark shadow, something like uh, evil spirit, like sitting on my body and trying to press my neck and uh, trying to take my life away. And uh, during that same time, I saw a, a beautiful light. Uh, and Mother Mary, she was standing near me. She came near me. She just pulled this dark power from my body and she uh, just threw it, uh, threw it away. And at that very moment, I was delivered and I all my fever went away. Uh, there was nothing. I just felt very comfortable. Next day morning, I call, called Father Benny. I shared this experience and uh, I took his prayer. And uh, I really thank God for saving me. I did not have any problem of Corona after that. Uh, neither I had to go for any test. And I uh, praise God and thank you, Mother Mary, for healing me totally. And I thank Father Benny and all the sisters who are praying for us. And all, we assure our prayers for all the sisters and Father Benny. Thank you. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord is blessing many people who have back-related problems, especially some people with dislocation in, in uh, different parts of the body. The Lord is touching them today. Some people with bone-related pain, especially the portion below the, uh, below the knee, uh, having lot of pain the Lord is touching many people some people who have heart related problems the Lord is touching them some people who are not at all feeling at ease such many people are being blessed today there are some people who have uh, different types of stomach disorders the Lord is healing them there are some people who have lot of skin problem so much so that they cannot wear proper dress on the body the lord is touching many of them continue to surrender and pray so that the grace of the lord will work with you may almighty god bless you heal you keep you safe in his heart now and always and forever amen 